What's going on guys, it's Marlon Lifestyle, and today I'm going to be doing a top 5 paint jobs list for you guys. So I already have the first one on my car as you can see, now I'm going to show you guys how to do this, but my friend HRG just gave this one to me, and it actually looks really really nice, I'm not sure how it looks on other cars, he had it on his Coquette, but I like it on my Warner, to be honest, I really do like this. So we're going to start off with number 5, and he is doing some donuts, hopefully it doesn't crash into me. But, uh, yeah, so we're going to go in here. I'm probably going to waste a bunch of money showing you guys this. But, I mean, who really cares? We have this double money and double RP heists anyways. So, basically, all you want to start with is a gasoline green metallic. So, scroll down until you find it. I think it's it's somewhere in the middle. It's not that far down yet. It's probably in the middle right here gasoline green now it, it doesn't even really look green in my opinion I think it looks more blue so you want to buy that and you want to get a secondary and then you want to go down to per pearlescent and you would get an ice white pearlescent so I already have that on here and it looks really good in different kinds of lights like it's kind of dark right here you can't really see the pearlescent but then when you come out here in the sunlight it really starts shining and uh, yeah so let's move on into number four so moving on into number four, we have a really cool salmon pink. So let me find pink real quick, and this looks really good on any car. I actually had this on my Chino a while back. I don't know if you guys follow me on Instagram, but if you don't, go ahead and click that button up there on my channel. And uh, yeah, so salmon pink, you want to put the secondary color as salmon pink as well as a metallic. And uh, it actually looks really, really nice. We're not done yet. We're going to put a, a metallic on it, but salmon pink. And then what you want to do from there is go to metallics. I'm at pearlescent. And you want to have a white or ice white pearlescent. Now, it doesn't really look too much inside the shop. But when you bring it outside, it looks really, really, really cool. I really like this paint job. It's something that I had on my Chino for a while. And I think it fitted the car. And I think it kind of fits this car as well. And there's my friend HRG once again hopping on my car and stuff like that. But anyways, yeah, so let's go ahead and move on into number three. Okay, so moving on into number three, we have a really cool orange. Now, I actually had this on my Osiris a while ago. And you guys might have seen my tutorial for this. But I decided, why not throw it in? So what you want to do is start out with an orange matte color and you want to do the pearlescent glitch so if you guys didn't know already you go to metallic hover over any of these go back 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 and then go to plate and just change up your plate i need to change the plate anyways i didn't like the white plate and then you want to go back and go into pearlescent and you want to put a um race yellow i believe let me see here uh if i can find it i can never find these things all right, yeah, race yellow. Now, this looks really, really, really cool, especially on supercars. I'm not really sure if I like it on this car necessarily, but in my opinion, if you have this on an Osiris or like a T20, it looks really, really super nice. And, uh, yeah, so on the Warner, not too much, but you're just going to have to experience with some other cars. But, uh, yeah, so let's number three, and let's move on into number two. So in the number two spot, we have a really cool blue, and for some reason, I really do like putting white metallics on my cars. So basically, all you want to do is you want to put in metallic ultra blue with a secondary ultra blue, and then finish it off with a pearlescent ice white. Now, like I said, I really do like the ice white pearlescence. I think it really just ties the car together, and it gives it a nice shine in different sunlights instead of just like... A normal little blue it actually looks really nice and different kinds of sunlight so you could take some pretty cool pictures if you could find the right lighting and uh, yeah so that's number two and let's move on into number one so moving on into the first and final paint job we have a really cool red so basically I already put matte red on here and I had to go and get some more money so you want to do the pearlescent glitch one more time so metallic go back go back go to plate and choose any of these plates, then go back to Resplay, Primary, Pearlescent, and you want to choose the Lime Green Pearlescent. Now, <clears throat> it doesn't really look too great on this car, in my opinion, but if you have something like a Pegasi Osiris or the T20, it looks really, really nice. On this car, it just does not fit it whatsoever. So I'm going to try to find some sunlight real quick and show you guys this. And I think it looks pretty cool. It gives it a nice kind of like burnt feeling to it. It looks cool. It's like orange and red. And it looks really, really nice in a different different kinds of sunlight. 
So basically, that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please like. And I'm sorry if this video was a little bit kind of like jumpy because uh, I, I was running low on money. I had to stop and do some other stuff during this video. So that's basically it. Thanks for watching, guys. And I'll see you guys in my next video.